The costuming world has been tumultuous this past year, to say the very least. But one thing I think we can all agree on is that we are fucking sick of this pandemic. I have been absolutely unmotivated and uninspired to do anything besides eat popcorn, watch duck videos, and look at pictures of costumes I wish I had the energy to make. When suddenly, it hit me. The costume that fully grasped my mood in the current times, right there, in plain sight. This book by Cesare Fagelio depicts several fashions from the 1580s in many regions in Italy, and I've always been perplexed by the prints that feature women wearing veils entirely over their heads. The description of this one reads, At this time they wear a fazuolo called a kappa of black silk that is very thin and covers their face, but not their breast, and even though it is not very thick, it still does not allow their covered faces even to be imagined. If this isn't a 16th century version of, I do not wish to be perceived, I don't know what is. Historically speaking, women have always had something, some technique, something to distance themselves often from the male gaze, and also just distance themselves in general from people. So this isn't surprising that this existed at the time, and I am all for it. I started to fantasize about what this sort of tool would be like today, and how masks in some way have given me and many other neurodivergent people the freedom to stop smiling and indicating our moods to others with our facial features. How masks have led to so many of us ironically unmasking because it's now socially acceptable to hide our faces. In the before times, a lot of my energy was spent making other people comfortable by showing them that I wasn't mad or worried, indicating that I was okay by smiling painfully, and honestly just pretending a lot, which is super stressful when you're anxious and depressed and stressed all the time. There are so many things I really don't have the energy to manage anymore, as losing some of the mask has made it harder to do. And more stress has resulted in less spoons. Less spoons means I can't waste them on highly challenging things like pretty much most of my human interactions. Do not get me wrong, I like sharing the same five outfits on Instagram on repeat, I'm sure you love it too, but in my regular life, um, peopling is not happening. In many ways, I just do not want to be perceived right now. I want to hang out in my pajamas for five days because who cares? Who cares at this point? Q 16th century Venice, in the book that I have, where you basically had the excuse to ignore everyone because you don't want to even be imagined. To make this project, all I needed was the most opaque yard of black silk I could find. Then the task of making scallops on the edges. Am I going to do this by hand? No. Just no. No. Stop asking. No. And to finish things off, some tassels. That was really easy. This speaks so much to my soul right now, it's ridiculous, but it will probably also keep people from bothering me. All that was left when I was done was to make an infomercial to go with it. I hope you enjoy my weird, strange, dark humor at the moment. Being perceived is such a chore in this day and age. Why can't people just stop asking anything from you and let you isolate in peace? Hi, I'm Amber, and if you're like me, you just don't want to do anything anymore. The chore of needing to pretend you do want to hear about your neighbor's vacation while Omicron plagues the planet is no longer a problem, thanks to the Venetian Veil. 
The Venetian veil is an ancient tool used to deflect any attention at all, and was created by wise men of the Italian Renaissance to prevent Italian women from ever being imagined. Sounds amazing, right? Used for centuries to discourage people from knowing your existence or your identity or even where you are walking, it's a great way to avoid anyone thinking you remotely want perception. Just watch as this veil scares the crap out of the PTA member who wants to come ask you to do something. Thanks, Phoenician Veil! Tired of people thinking they can have an opinion on anything you wear or look like? Deflect them all by dressing as an ominous creature they're too scared to have an opinion about. Thanks, Phoenician Veil! Now you have time for the important things, pondering your existence and the fate of humanity. Available for order nowhere because you need to make one yourself. I'm not gonna do it and don't look at me because I'm wearing my Venetian veil!